Hello and welcome to the Reddit recap for the month of July, where I look at the top stuff from that month that was given by the 65,000 members that I now have. There seems to be some interesting stuff here. This is probably the most upvoted post of all time and it has 3.4k... Wait, why does it have 3,400 comments? Well, we're hopping right into it apparently. Matto has been good. Profanity counter. Uh-oh, someone has been using stinky language and Blade B208 decided to check Dark Viper AU's bad word usage. I've gone back 1,000 posts and comments and reviewed their potty language usage. However, the plans were foiled. Dark Viper AU is a good Christian boy. I am none of those things. Wait, I am a boy, presumably. And the reason why this didn't work is because I deleted all my Reddit history fairly recently. Yeah, I've, I've exactly one comment. This dude sent a message to my business email for facts and glitches. And I said to him, hey, my business email, email isn't for facts and glitches submissions. And he comes back on Reddit and he starts crying at me. And I'm like, there are hundreds of submissions for facts and glitches. If I received them in my business email, I would never be able to read business emails. And my managers read it as well. What, you want to send them hundreds of facts and glitches submissions? And your people seem to fairly agree that that guy was being unreasonable. And th this is my only comment chat. In fact, I'm tempted to delete it so I have no comments at all. So yes, I am not a good Christian boy. I am a boy, though. As said by that guy from God of War. Boy! What are you doing, boy? Being a good Christian boy won't stop Jesus from showing his mercy. I mean, that's, that's more enough evidence that I'm a not good Christian boy. Like, if you played the Chaos mod and you were a good Christian boy, then Jesus would just be passive all the time. You think he's programmed to always be hostile? Not at all. He's only hostile to those who aren't good Christian boys. So if you've played Chaos Mod and Jesus attacked you and you thought you were a good Christian boy, let me tell you, you're wrong. <laughs> but why is there 3,400 comments? Oh, because everyone is checking how many times they've sworn. Oh, wait, Lamau is a swear word? <laughs> You've said Lamau 25 times? Ban this fool from my subreddit. Look at all these potty mouth people in chat right now typing Lamau. Come on now. It's a good Christian stream led by a not good Christian boy, okay? <laughs> Dark Joker AU. I spent many hours on this one. Hope you like it. Colon D. Can you please stop bothering my kid? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> <laughs> That's really funny. I didn't see that last part coming. You disingenuous dead motherfucker. Obviously you have to do something about witness protection or you couldn't tie your shoes. <laughs> That's a way to combine so many of my memes together, dude. That's amazing. I present to you Oko is Pain. I hope my two hours wasted on this were worth it. Hello and welcome to what is hopefully my final attempt at completing GTA 5 without taking any damage. I have a max HP of 1, so any damage from any source will immediately kill me. Unfortunately, due to a copyright claim, the majority of this meme must be removed. That was very well made. Brilliant. Uh, I couldn't have to say that. Just, uh, just perfect. I, I have no criticisms or critiques. Uh, that was definitely not two hours wasted. Very good. Thank you so much. For those who watch on YouTube, it wouldn't seem like I've taken much of a break, but I haven't done an Oko run in like two months now. Looking at me at the end there, where, like the last couple of runs I did, I, I was no longer yelling when I died. I was just, hmm. Definitely crushed my spirit how many times I was cheated. But I'm coming back to Oko, and I'm going to be... There's a lot of strat changes, because I've, I've taken two months off, so other people have developed stuff. I'm going to be following a guide um, made by... Well, I call him Well, but Well Hezel. Well, there's a bunch of contributors to it. What annoys me about learning new strats, though, is that it was possible for me to succeed a year ago, when I only had one death. This last year of strat developments making it easy has been all completely unnecessary. There was no reason in the last year that I shouldn't have been able to succeed at some point. But it just never happened. 
it still eats me up inside thinking about it. So the main reason I'm making, I'm going to be using new strats is not because I necessarily need them to succeed, but that they will increase my likelihood at least somewhat. And it'll be more interesting for the future episodes for new things to fucking happen. Not like the last four or five episodes of Oko on YouTube where no developments have been made. It's just been me slowly building up the failure. Dave Viper AU. <laughs> Point of view, you're Dave. Davey. <laughs> it's very good. As far as that hasn't been done before, that's, uh, that's, that's brilliant. Thank you. How you doing? What the fuck, Michael? Do you just jump out of a blimp? Matto in about two months. Hello and welcome to what is hopefully my final attempt at completing GT5 GeoGuessr without losing any points. I have a max point loss of one, so any incorrect guess would immediately fail. I also want this to be a no zoom run, so the computer's zoom in function has been disabled. <laughs> because while you can zoom in by squinting, you can get better guesses by zooming in on the computer. I have successfully completed every single location in the game. I have yet to do it all in one go. My current personal best for this run is one incorrect location and therefore one point loss. So I'm hoping for this to be the last run and avoid all point loss altogether. <laughs> That's so brilliant, dude. You are you are one creative bastard, uh, Eric V. Bossy. Very good. I am not doing this. <laughs> What is this picture? I've never seen this picture in the 8,000 hours of speedrun in this game. This game sucks. Uh, I'm getting old, chat. That yelling actually hurt. <laughs> the mod was programmed by infants. You have no conception of how rare that picture is. It is millions to one. Are oh, you for real? We're, get we're hitting all the classic memes right now, chat. Ah. Uh, I was wondering in the story of GTA 5, is Michael in witness protection? Hi, I am Joseph. I am a rockstar expert. I'll be assisting you in this matter today. Yes, he is in witness protection. Oh no. Joseph, you are wrong. In 2013, when Rockstar was talking about Michael, they said he's in an unofficial witness protection. That was their line. And as I've explained before, it's because the circumstances of his relationship with the FIB is too complicated to fit into one fucking sentence. And people who only half listen to the story will, of course, come away with the conclusion that he is in witness protection. But he's not. The main thing that distinguishes Michael's circumstances from actual witness protection is that he's been protected not only from criminal elements, but also justice. Because he never saw his day in court. He's not officially on the books. He's dead on the books. Witness protection doesn't protect you from justice. It enables a person to achieve justice. Yeah, I doubt this is from Rockstar anyway, but still. Fridge reveal. POV Meadows Fridge. Wait, Pepsi has just their own warehouse? Oh, I, I guess that makes sense. There should be a Max added on to here somewhere. But yeah, that is actually all I have in my fridge. Just Pepsi. I mean, what else would you want? What else do you need? Just a typical Chaos Mod stream. G Grand Theft Auto 5 Chaos Mod. Tonight on Chaos Mod, I try to stop chat from holding my virginity hostage. Creeper Jesus attempts to extend his shlong using the Large Hadron Collider, while Brad reincarnates as an attractive Pokemon using Disney Fast Play. What is this? How was this made? Did you write this and then specifically look for words to put here? Did you write this and then just make a bunch of different fonts? How did this happen? Is this generated from an AI? If so, we're doomed. What have I done? Awful, terrible. I feel like I can't tie my shoes. Angry, cute, wide, orange. This is awful. And it is terrible. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> this is awful, very good. I didn't say very good. Well, I did when I read this, but that doesn't count, okay? Matto's worst nightmare. Oh my god, you merged an oppressor with a horse! You fucking monster! No, actually, I think this is actually preferable. I think a horse-oppressor hybrid would actually be better than just the horse. If you can mod Red Dead Redemption 2 so that all the horses are replaced with horse-oppressor hybrids, I will play through the game again. That would save, like, 30 hours of time. This is very good. I like it. Thank you. It was Matto all along. Brown hair, facial hair, yee ass haircut, thick, this is Matto. You got me, guys. Some of my first forays into movies was being this 
animated version of myself. As you can see, there are huge protruding tusks coming out of my face at all times. Maybe you didn't notice until now, like, but they've always been there. No sleeves, see, it's 100% identified as me. It's good enough to make a grown man cry. I can't believe he didn't cry during Titanic. Do men even have feelings? <laughs> yeah. I mean, I was emotional. Uh, I'm sometimes an emotional guy. To prove this, I did cry during the Titanic. It was 2 a.m. The movie had been out for like a bajillion years. I had never seen it. I watched it by myself in the dark. I was already feeling a bit blue. And just the screams and cries of the people as they died just fucking hit me hard. I just felt so sad for them. And I cried a bit. Most normal people probably just cried when, when she had to let him go. Because, well, he could have clearly fit on the door, but... He'd sacrificed himself, whatever. But me, I was just feeling so terrible for all the people who were suffering on the boat. Through no fault of their own, they were all die they all dying, and I just I just it just overwhelmed me. <laughs> Spoilers! <laughs> I'm sorry I spoiled the Titanic for you guys. I'm a bit slow, okay? When you get to the stream just to see Matt say goodbye. This this is awful. <laughs> Why, why have you intentionally put my eyes closer than they normally are? This makes me uncomfortable. What have you done? Like, if you were just gonna recreate Mike Wazowski from Monsters, Inc., why not give me one eye? Like, this is terrible. But thank you. Well then, not what I was expecting to see today. I'm just gonna go and think. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm confused too. A speedrunner rambles, but nothing has changed. What? What? What is this shit? A speedrunner rambles again. McDonald's CEO rejected my lap dance. Committing tax fraud again. Blowing ISIS leader for pacifist uploads. Tonight on a speedrunner rambles, I rant about the Macca's CEO rejecting my lap dance so I could pay for my $702 Big Mac. I confess to committing tax fraud with Yoshi and I whip out Microsoft Paint to show that blowing the leader of ISIS will help me complete pacifist. Okay, there's some website making this shit. What, this This is called Bottom Gear? I've seen Bottom Gear before. Yeah, Bottom Gear. There you go. I know what that is. Is, is that what's creating this, though? Is that the name of a bot or something? The show is called Top Gear. I know what the show is called! The meme of it's called Bottom Gear! I don't need to Google Bottom Gear! I know what Bottom Gear is! Nah! Matto now believes Michael was in witness protection. Various times over the years, people have indicated that they believe that Michael was never actually in witness protection in the story of GTA 5. If you play the game and listen to the dialogue, Michael was actually in witness protection. Some of you might be thinking, Michael was never in witness protection. Witness protection for what? Michael betrayed Brad and Trevor. He set up a deal and he bailed. He got out. He betrayed Brad and Trevor to save his own neck. And that's why Trevor is so pissed at the end of Derailed, where Trevor's like, you blew the identities! I didn't have access to my millions! The reason why Michael's in witness protection is Trevor is a crazy psychopath. Michael references all the time, like, you can you can never trust that guy. He could just do something crazy at any minute. I'm gonna get that fucking Michael Townley. It's the last thing I do. And of course, Michael doesn't want that shit hanging over his head. And so Michael just went into witness protection. But I hope this helps you understand a bit of GTA 5 lore. Have a good one. There are people who unironically in that comment section said that the reason why Michael went into witness protection was to protect himself from Trevor. Th the deal was set up beforehand, people, and the plan was to kill Trevor. So why would Michael set up a deal to go into witness protection before the heist, believing that Trevor was going to die to protect himself from Trevor, who was meant to die? People unironically typed that in the comment section. I am calm, I'm, ju I'm just saying. Why is Matto on the cover of Hunting Simulator? I am not that handsome. And I do not have a gun, because I'm Australian. I also don't have any beanies. I've also never gone outside. <laughs> this is definitely not me. <laughs> he has sleeves, he's not Matto, that as well. No explanation needed. Are you for real? Question mark. Awful. It looks like to make this orange, all you did was get the spray function on paints and just go over it a bit. Talk about a spray tan. I made Matt and his house in Sims 4 
and it took way too long. Apollo. Drama. It even has my favorite catchphrase, Zorpomish. I say that all the time. It's pretty accurate. Uh, small things of difference, but uh, very cool. <laughs> now put in Jesus and make them marry. <laughs> JFK arriving in the afterlife be like. Who the fuck shot me? <laughs> it's very good. Sims Viper AU. Michael was lying. He was never actually in witness protection. So here's the story of GTA 5, guys. Hey, you. Yeah, you. You disingenuous. You dense disingenuous, dense motherfucker. Obviously, you have to know something Obviously, about- Obviously, you have to know something about something, or you couldn't tie your fucking shoes. No! <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? Man, what the hell going on here? <laughs> that's Jesus. Oh god, that's Jesus. That is that is the Jesus guy. <laughs> that was pretty damn good. Very good. Thank you. You woke up one day and you just had this vision in your head and you made it. What Matt saw versus what we saw. Look, I, I it's totally valueless. Uh, 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 nailed it. Ah! Change direction! Beyblades can't. Wait a second, Daryl. The Queen is in the wreckage. There's no way the rookie can make it through. Not in one piece, that is. <laughs> I've never seen cars. I don't get it. But, uh, thank you. POV, Dark Viper EU, roast you, portrait two. Hey, that's amazing. Because obviously I'm, I'm replacing Franklin. Not Franklin, Lamar, God damn it. It's, it's, it's beautiful. Uh, it's, it's perfect. Slightly lighter shorts, black shirt, rent hoodie. Yeah, it's amazing, thank you so much. 8,000 hours, never seen this once. All right, Brad's gonna be fine. We gotta get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> Told ya. That shot's literally impossible. That shot has never happened before in the history of me running this game. I have practiced that hundreds upon hundreds upon hundreds of times and never seen that even once. That was really well done. Uh, the cropping and uh, that, was, that was beautiful. That's true. I have never seen that in over 8,000 hours. I asked Rockstar support. Here's what I got. Is Michael from story mode in witness protection? Rockstar has not confirmed it nor deny it. I myself think he is, although that's one of the best witness protection programs. Witness protection for what? No one was convicted of anything. No one was convicted, but Trevor was out there. But Trevor doesn't know Michael is alive, so Michael would have no reason to be in witness protection. Right. Interesting. Oh, so this is an actual dude from Rockstar. You see, that's what I mean. It's, it's impossible for Michael to have made a deal to go in witness protection to protect him from Trevor when Trevor was the one he, he believed was going to die during the scheme. It's possibly. It's fake. I don't know. It is the same guy. What are the odds it's the same guy? Okay, maybe this is all kind of fake. Yeah, guys, stop stop DMing the Rockstar people about this. It's the, Okay, the people who answer your messages 
in the messaging on Rockstar are not somehow authorities on the GTA 5 story. It's not like day one, they're like, look, okay, so you want to be a media representative, a support staff, perhaps, for the company. How much do you know about the Rockstar story? How many times have you played through the game? Do you have at least 10,000 hours specifically in single player? No? Can't take you then, I'm sorry. Like, they're just guys who probably like the game just as much as the rest of us, but it doesn't mean they're going to understand the story fully. And obviously, as I've said before, the story in GTA V was never meant to be groundbreaking. It was just meant to be something that facilitated gameplay, you know? And it does that very well. Definitely, Matto, you actually did make me as Mac was asking. I mean, I asked for it moments ago, and that reality is now given it to me. I, I guess I should be thankful. This is awful. You know, you know it's awful. You, you looked at it when you were done. You were like, this is the worst thing ever made. I'm gonna put that shit on the Dark Viper AU subreddit. Thank you. Don't be like Jimmy, be like Blue Ball. Jimmy, jerks of every day. Play video games all the time. Has bad friends. Takes drugs. Doesn't want to do any activities with his father. While trying to sell his father's boat for drug money, he loses it to scrammers. Blue ball. Moves. Does nothing wrong. No monetary harm to Michael. Don't drugs, Michael. English aside, I agree with the premise of this meme. The blue ball is definitely better than Jimmy. Blue ball definitely should replace the main character's child in GTA 6. How do I know that the main character has children in GTA 6? Well, maybe I just know more things about GTA 6 than you, Chad. It's hard to exercise when your dad shoots you with an RPG every time you get on your bike. <laughs> we can do better, guys. Disingenuous, dense motherfucker. Boo! Get better material. Uh, beard, white male, this is matter. Red Redemption 2. Dark Viper AU and a different country. I mean... This, this, you're still using them in creative ways. I'm sure some of it isn't very good, but that shit doesn't really get uploaded, so it's fine. I found this at my local car dealership. I have absolutely no idea what this references. No idea at all. I'm lost. They don't tell you this when you plan to speedrun the game for 8,000 hours. That you're going to build these weird associations between the game and parts of life. But it happens all the time. At least he's in witness protection. How did Trevor find me? Also, Michael. Rob DeBank organizer. Is that real? Is the guy's name really Rob DeBank? If my last name was Bank, would I name my son or daughter Rob Da? I mean, it'd be so tempting. I mean, my last name is Judge. It's a little bit tempting to call my son or daughter Judge. So they can be called Judge Judge. <laughs> it's always been the joke though, because if I became a judge, I'd be Judge Judge. Dark Loki AU. What was your Nexus event? I completed One Hick Hair. You'd have to watch the show to get it, but it is really funny. It wasn't meant to be. Prune him from the timeline. <laughs> like that's ever gonna happen. Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me. I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. I accidentally stopped the video at the right time. <laughs> Look, you can do that to every single YouTuber. Grab anyone and just pause or move frames. Everyone looks fucking stupid on a couple of frames, okay? I mean, I look kind of stupid on probably more frames than average. I would almost argue most frames I look quite stupid, but you know, there are some that I look fine, okay? <laughs> I found Matto's Spotify playlist. Matto Angry, 44 minutes. You disingenuous, dense motherfucker. Obviously you have to know something about something or you couldn't tie your shoes. Very good. <laughs> this song sucks I'm deleting this song. I fixed him and he doesn't look like Thanos. I'd rather just this picture didn't, like, didn't exist, you know? But yes, this is a much of an improvement. Thank you. I would still never use this photo anywhere. And the hair mess. Petition for Matto to recreate this at 100k members on Reddit. It wouldn't, like, I know where that little horse is. I could totally recreate it. Be like a 20 minute drive. I got no one to hold the camera though. Do it? We'll see. Petition for Matto to do orange ball percent. If you had been watching Chaos, there's a mode where it actually spawns in an orange ball and it can't be moved. So, can't do it. You need, uh, like a hill. Or, I guess you need to use a car? Yeah, I, I guess if I use the car. You can't just bodily move it. We'll see. Dad Viper AU. I like that one child's just like, what the fuck? And the other child's looking at me like, oh, he's yelling. Isn't he cute? 
<laughs> I don't know why you made this. It can't be done. I believe in you, Matto. Yeah, maybe I'll make the video. We'll see. I mean, it didn't get 100k likes, chat. How many likes is it at right now? It's at 52,000 likes. You gotta pump up those numbers. We believe in you. Matto chat. I'm gonna do a run in the snow. Sure, Grandma, let's get you to bed. I don't get it. Oh, oh, I see. Because for the longest time, I said I'm going back to speed running. And when I go back to speed running, I'm going to do modded runs. And the first modded run I ever said I wanted to do was an entire run with the game in snow. And so it's been literally years since I wanted to do that. And I still haven't done it. I'll get there eventually. Finn made intro for Oko. No! <laughs> Millions to one edition. <laughs> that was very good. Very well made. Very good. Meme sucks, but that's okay. Oko percent, pacifist percent, yoga ball percent. It was a good video. I love that little doge with his little bat. It's a good meme. Good stuff. The six best things you will find on Matto's channel. Come to Matto's streams. We have Oko, Aimbot Peds, Doomsday Heist, Poor Boy, Speed Running, Flip All Vehicles, Slay the Spire, In the Hood, Pacifist, Peds Are Brainless, Chaos, Suicide. True. Good meme. An interesting title. <laughs> when the motherfucker is disingenuous. <laughs> I am kind of looking like, I'm kind of fed up with your shit, dude. Where do you guys find these photos? I'm glad you asked. Uh, I have an Instagram that I now post to occasionally with stuff. If you don't like Twitter, but you want to see me post, like, fan stuff sometimes, and other stuff, Instagram's for you, DarkFapAU at Instagram. I, I even got the, uh, the DarkFapAU TikTok recently, so my name is now DarkFapAU on TikTok, too. you should follow me there. Always a good sign. When Matt is on minor turbulence and the video still has a long time left. I love that picture of Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh, <laughs> dawn of the second run. <laughs> yeah, just because the video has a lot longer longer left doesn't mean I necessarily got my fast minor turbulence. Very good. I mean, the stress for minor turbulence these days, like, I, I shouldn't ever really die there. But of course, there was that one time where the dude fucking missed and so clipped me. Like, it's actually now in the guide for Oko. Like, oh yeah, so they don't actually shoot you, but if he misses, it's technically possible for him to clip you. Like, ah, oh, fuck God, I can't believe that guy shot me. Dark fight that you screaming montage, but it's in Gangster's Paradise. And that just immediately goes perfect. No! 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 Oh! Oh! That is insane. That was insane. Very good, dude. That was, uh, that was very well done. Very good. Matto, a good and clever meme. Very good. <laughs> That's really funny. Uh, <laughs> and this is this is from uh, the Avengers or whatever. Like it's, a, it's an old meme format, but it checks out. Very good. My grandma's cat is named Davy. Davy, how you doing? <laughs> oh my god! I if I get a pet, I have to call it Davy. I would do that every day and smile to myself. That would enrich my life so much. And that is a, a damn cute cat. Cats play like, I don't know why, it's so, so affectionate all of a sudden, it keeps asking me how I'm going, but it's pretty good. <laughs> Thank you for watching, Thank you for hanging out. You want to contribute to the subreddit with the other 65,000 lovely people here. Follow my subreddit and upvote stuff so I can see the best stuff. If your submission didn't make it in, don't worry. At the end of the year, there'll be like a big... Matt goes back and looks at stuff that he missed out on. Who knows how many I'll go through it. Like, I might go through 500 or something. Who knows? Just to find those hidden gems that I'm missing out on. Uh, so, you know, I appreciate everything you guys do for me, especially the submissions and the upvoting. And uh, I hope you're doing great.